What's up? What's up? How are you guys doing? Uh, so, today, um, gonna be playing some Space Crew. And, uh, this is actually a game that was given to me from, uh, Curve Digital. They, they sent me a copy of the game, and this is, like, a sponsored stream. It's the same thing as a bounty would be. Uh, they sent me a game code, and, uh, this is basically, from what I understand, it's kind of like a management sim where you make your own crew and you, like, go into space and stuff and just get into all kinds of crazy shenanigans. It looked really fun, and their other games that they've made are, like, really, really good. Uh, Curve Digital is the, um, I believe the... They are... They're not the developer. The developer is Rudder Duck. Curve Digital is the, um... Why, why is this word escaping me right now? The publisher. Sorry. <laughs> Jesus. Anyways, let's see what this game is. Is All right, let's make a first save. Let's go. Yeah, it's the same devs as Bomber Crew, right? Eh? But this one's like very trekky. Welcome to Athena Station. We have a mission that needs your immediate attention. It appears a module in a comms array by the moon is malfunctioning. We're not expecting any complications. This will serve as a perfect opportunity to go over some basic training. So this is like FTL then. We need you to go and retrieve the module, repair it on your ship, and deposit it back into the comms array. Okay. Uh... So I have... Select your captain by clicking directly on their panel. So we have Villareal. Malka, Barua, Mate, Bensley, and Marden. I want Bensley. Bensley's a good name. It sounds like Bentley, which is another great name. Very good name. Look at the name of the ship. Where does, what's the name of the ship? Do we have it? Where is it? Eh? The Chum Bucket. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good ship name. <laughs> okay. Uh, I have clicked them. I guess now, uh... This is Captain. I am clicking the Captain. Now what? What do I do after I click the Captain? Wait a second. Huh? Nothing is happening. The big arrow. Oh, does it have to? Oh, it has to be Villareal. Oh, I thought I got to select one of these dudes. I'm so, I'm so dumb. Vila is the captain. I wanted Bensley to be the captain. I thought I was selecting the captain from a group of people. Oh God, I'm stupid. All right. Well, this will be great. This is off to a good start already. Bensley's the real captain. Villareal, they're all right, but but my captain is Bensley. Desert, they're not qualified. Deselect your captain. I'm selecting Bensley. Zoom in and out with the scroll wheel or the up and down arrows. Okay. Whoa. You can zoom out very far. While zoomed out, hold the right button and move to rotate the camera around the ship. Oh, neat. Ooh. It doesn't lock my cursor to the window, though. Uh-oh. Gotta keep that in mind. Click the mouse wheel or press space bar. Oh, the middle mouse wheel or press space bar to toggle tagging mode. Okay. While in tagging mode, aim the camera using the mouse at the jump gate. Earth. To tag it. Oh, okay. When you tag a waypoint, for example, a jump gate, your captain will pilot the ship towards it. Okay. This is kind of reminding me of EVE. Depending on the type of waypoint, your ship will orbit or align with it. Alright. 
exit tagging mode by pressing the middle mouse button or the space bar. Press tab to enter fast forward mode. You can only use fast forward when there are no enemies around. All right. So the reason I actually felt like picking this up when I was approached with the sponsorship is because like, we've been watching a lot of like Star Trek, <laughs> me and the fellas. And I don't know, it got me in the mood for like a space game. And then, I don't know, the, uh, the Curved Digital fellas came along and they were like, hey, do you want to play our game? And I was like, yes. And that's that. They gave it to me. Sponsored stream. Select your captain. When you're orbiting a tag jump gate, you can charge your hyper jump. Press charge on your captain's panel to start charging. Charging for hyper jump. Power diverted to engines. You are charged for hyper jump. Pre select engage from your captain's control panel. Engage! What? Earth. The moon. What's up, T-Man? Where's Worf? Uh, Bensley is Worf. And the captain. Looks like we've got some uninvited guests. Our scanners are picking up incoming phasma activity to your location. We're uncertain how many are on their way. So make sure all your weapons are stationed. Well, all your weapon stations are manned. Uh, weapon stations? Oh, okay. Barua. I guess you'll be our O'Brien. Move your engineer to the ship's weapon station by left-clicking on it. Okay? Okay? Select your security officer by clicking on them. Okay. Move your security officer, officer to the ship's front. Where are you? Okay, you're here. So... But you're already in the front. Oh, you're going here. Move the camera over a little bit. Click the mouse wheel, press spacebar to toggle tagging mode. Okay. While in tagging mode, aim the camera use, uh, using mouse at the incoming Phasmid fighters to fight them. Oh, this is space battles? What the fuck? That's awesome! I really like that. Crew at tar tar weapon station will attack targeted enemies. Oh, okay. Do I have, like, shield levels and stuff? This is actually surprisingly, like, complex. Whoop! There we go. Get it! Exit tagging mode by pressing the middle mouse button or space bar. All right. So, <laughs> there they go! Uh, okay, okay. All shields restored. Okay, so we do have shields to manage. Got it. So we're currently fighting, like, what? Like, space phasmids? Are they like the Borg? Are they like the, the, the uh, Dominion? Good work. That looks like the last of them. Repair the probe and return to base. Hmm. Have you tried diplomacy? I did. I, sh I shot diplomacy bullets right at them, and they ignored them until they pierced their hull and then blew them up. It happens sometimes. Tag the communications array to align it. Communications array. Communications array. Uh... Communications array... Is... Where? Where is it? Repair communications array. I don't know where it is. Is it... Oh, wait. Is it... Oh, this is it, right? I think? Or... Is it here? I'm not sure where this is. Where is the communications array? It wants me to repair it, but... Oh, I'm stupid. Jesus. First day being a pilot captain on my ship. It's out in space. Oh, I like the music. It's gone now. Eh? Okay, exit tagging mode. Go! Select your engineer by uh, directly clicking on them and going to the panel. 
Move your engineer to the ship's tractor beam station. We got tractor beams and shit? Alright. Select your engineer. Okay, yeah, yeah. Move- Oh, I keep- I kept right-clicking. That's a- uh, That unclicks him. Retrieve the broken communications array processing unit using the tractor beam station's retrieve button. Okay. Pull that shit in! Send your engineer to repair the communications array processing unit. Barua, fix it, quick! Your engineer will now repair the communications array component. Move your engineer to the ship's tractor beam station by left clicking on it. But what if I leave him in here and activate the airlock? Will he get sucked out into space? Use the tractor beam to deposit the repaired processing unit back into the communications array. There you go. Return to Athena Station by tagging the jump gate. Right, got a tag mode, and there it is. And away we go! And now we select the captain, right? I think? We have to hyper jump now, don't we? Oh wait, no. Oh, I selected the communications relay. Whoops. There it is. Jeez. Now we do it. Well, we gotta wait to get there first. When you're orbiting a tagged jump gate, you can charge for hyper jump. Press charge in your captain's panel. Start charging. Let's get out of here. Power diverted to all engines. Let's go! Whoa! Wow, Ert. I named the Ert. I discovered this planet. It's mine. Tag the landing waypoint on the Athena station to land and complete the mission. Okay. Got up. Yeah. There we go. Look at. I like how this is like 3D and you can see your ship flying around and stuff. That's actually a really nice. That's a really nice touch. This is good. This is really good. Oh yeah, Pagona Bot has a link to the game if you want to play it. It's on Steam. It's uh it's actually on sale right now. It's like a $20 game, but right now it's like 15 or 16 bucks. It's pretty good so far. I like it. I can't believe my ship is called the Chum Bucket. Is this a demo or the full game? This is the full game. The devs gave me the full game. It's a sponsored stream. Crew status. Don't get too attached to them, fellas. They might not live that long, knowing games like this. Does this mean your captain went to college? Yes, he went to captain school. The mess hall? Huh? One mission's completed, zero crew members lost, 1,000 total credits earned. Okay, so you get like mission statistics too. Options. Uh, large UI, huh. With, ooh, okay, I like that. That's much more legible, thank you. Uh, that's a good feature. Let's see, internal camera sense. Yeah, that's fine. You can play this with a controller, I suppose, if you want. If you want. Controls seem rather simple. You can speed up time, slow time, look around space. About mess hall. Uh, you can get a glimpse into the comings and goings of life on Athena in the mess hall. Events taking place during the war against the Phasmids are also broadcast on the television screen here. Okay. And then there's like training, crew gear, holster equipment items. Oh, your, your dudes get into like fights. You get phasers and there's like revive tools and personal shields. Oh, this is complex. I like this. Okay, cool. These devs also have tank crew in addition to bomber crew. 
Yeah, I've heard these games are really, really fun. So far, I really like this. This is the mission briefing room. Select a mission for your crew. Enemy forces at Phobos. Do you remember when Buzz Aldrin was like talking about the monolith on Phobos and how it was like a secret that no one what no one should know? <laughs> was that wheel? Was there really a monolith on Phobos? Or is he just a old man telling stories? Although this is a real combat mission, there are still few features of your ship that will need you to try out. These games get hectic, hope you, hope you can multitask under pressure. Oh boy, you know me, I'm the best under pressure, I got this all under control. At some points during the mission, some control of your ship and crew will be locked for training purposes. Okay. Select your captain. Launch! Can I rename my ship? I want to rename my ship the Cacho. Click the mouse wheel or press the space bar to toggle tagging mode. I, I assume when I'm out of the tutorial, I get to rename my ship or like make a new one. Okay. Tagging mode time. Where are we going? To the objective. To Mars! Speed up! With the tab button. So it's like FTL. Yeah. It's like a really, really advanced FTL. When you're orbiting a tag jump gate, you can charge for hyper jump. You're right. I like how the tutorial is making sure I do know all the right buttons. That's good. Desert needs that. I'm very forgetful. Ooh. Okay, before you hyper jump, let's run through how your ship's reactor works. Select your engineer. Gonabot's going off a little bit too much. Let's see. I'm gonna adjust that threshold really quick. Let's make it like that. Yeah, that that'll work. Perfect. Select your engineer by clicking directly on them. Okay. Barua. This is the engineer's station panel. From here, you can modify reactor output to the ship's different systems. Shields, weapons, engineers, engines, and gravity generator. Yeah, Pagonabot's just excited. They, they wanted to play the space game. They want everyone to know. While charging for your hyper jump, four units of power will be diverted and locked to the engines. Okay, so we have, like, power units to manage, too. Oh, um, also, easy peasy, thank you for the 14 months. Fern the dev, thank, uh, thank you for the host, and, um, Epic11, thank you very much for the, uh, 34 months. Almost three years of watching the good lizard boy. By the way, congrats on beating Fatalis and Monster Hunter. You're now as much of a pro gamer as Limes. That was the biggest rush I've ever had in any game. It was amazing. I... I want to do that again. Okay, until it's upgraded, the reactor has only four units of power. But thank you very much for the 34 months. That's that's almost three years. Thank you. So currently, all your reactor power is being used to charge for hyper jump. Okay. Notice your energy weapons are showing that they do not have any power to operate. Right. Your gravity generator and shield recharger are also without power. If you complete your hyper jump, reactor output will be returned to a previously set balance. And everything will be operational again. Okay. This makes me very vulnerable while I do this. Select your captain. All right, let's hyper jump. This is actually in line with like Star Trek and stuff too. Like they always have to like power down other things to get out of there. If they need to like warp. And then if they're getting fired upon, like they can't just warp out of there. It's really difficult. Select your engineer. Okay. Try removing a unit of power from the gravity generator. Okay. Notice your gravity generator is indicating that it has got not got enough power to operate. All right. So. Try adding a unit of power to your weapons. So now my weapons are powered up. 
Energy weapons require power in order to operate. They are more effective with more power. Non-energy weapons, uh, something. Oh god, that went too fast. Select your security officer by selecting them. Okay. All right, Matei. Move your security officers to the ship's left. Here we go. Notice how your security officer has difficulty moving around the ship with the gravity generator unpowered. <laughs> That's a nice touch. I like that. Enemies incoming. Full ship and crew control has been returned to you. It said non-energy weapons have limited ammo. Oh, okay. Set reactor power to your preference and move your crew to weapon stations as required. Okay. Uh, click the mouse. Okay, let's get into tagging mode. Uh, all right, let's fight. Everyone's on a gun, right? We have, we have our guns manned. Get up! Eh. Weapon effectiveness 100%, aim accuracy 30. Wow, we we got stormtrooper aim, bro. Your accuracy sucks. Yeah, it does. Uh, upper shields restored. Do you have a self-destruct button? Uh, Barua. Uh, more power! Oh, God, wait, never mind. What if... Cut the engines! More weapons! This is a power move. This is a power move. Yeah! Wait, gotta take them out too. Get them! Take them out! Okay. Are they still fighting us? Yes, they are. So wait, what is our ship at? What are our shields at? How do I check? Oh, shields are at four. What? Oh, God. Get out of there. We got to go. Our shields are almost gone. Get it, get it, get it. How do I get more accurate, like, with my guns? Yeah, our shields in the in the front were getting really screwed up. But okay, now they're now they're restored back to normal. Okay, so now I can do um Well, this shield's screwed. I was going to say, now I can, like, focus more on having, uh, weapons, but I think we won the encounter. I don't think there are any more things to fight. So, navigate to Mars. What is Matei doing? Uh, she's just floating about, you know? Going for a float. Not. There she- now she's back in her security seat. It's like a booster seat. But for, like, security chiefs only. Okay. Let's charge this up. All power diverted to engines, go! We're at Phobos! Wow. Looks like a block of cheese. Space. The final frontier. Wait. Oh, wait. Is that... Is that Phobos? No, that's Mars. That's Phobos. Okay. Now I need to clear enemies again. All right. Let's see. What are we looking at? Uh, Engines to that. Shields up. Oh god, no, Barua, get back in your chair! Barua, your chair! What are you doing? Ooh. Ooh, our shields are getting melted, what the? Overdrive, overdrive the reactor, making more units of power available for a short time. The reactor... 
will leak radiation while this is active. That doesn't sound very good. Huh? Are we winning? Oh, God. Are you winning, son? Captain, she can't take much more. Huh? Oh, hey, look, my accuracy has gone up. Destroyed enemy fighter, rear shields restored. Good. Oh, God, we're like completely. Shoot those! Shoot these dudes! They're like. Hey! This guy! Kill! You're just letting him pick on us! Matang! What are you doing? Oh my god! Matang! Hurry! We're going to die! There we go. Oh man, Martin's almost dead. We can't aim for shit. No, we can't. Martin's got to get to the. Martin's got to get to the uh, the healing station. You need a front gunner. Ah, uh, damn it. Yeah, I do. Bensley, go, go, Bensley, go. Huh? We need gravity. Okay, we no longer need gravity. Uh, weapons. Just pump them up. Do the shoot! They're coming in from the, the, the from the south quadrant. Something. Uh. Bensley's in the wrong chair. Nope. Th this is his chair now. Wait, is this not a gun? Oh wait, no, that's the gun. This is the. <laughs> I did put him in the wrong chair. Help! Farua, we need shields. Oh God, we might need to overdrive. We're out of shields, like on the front and the bottom of our ship. I am a bad captain. Huh? Go warp nine? No, never go warp nine. What? Take care of that guy. Matei! Martin! Bensley! You got a bogey on your tail! That's an eject- eject the warp core! I don't even know what that means! Uh... Huh? Okay. Alright. We got- we got enemies in- uh, above and above ins. Uh, there seems to only be one left. I think is are you it? Oh no, there's one over here. <gasps> oh, he's got a shield. Uh, Matang, get in front. Here, uh, have some gravity so you can run. Okay, no longer gravity. No longer need gravity. Whoop! The girl's gravity. Take it out. Take it out. Take it out. It's backing off. Good. <laughs> Our hole has been breached! You better run! Durr. Nice. All right, Matei, go back to your chair. You're done good. Mission objectives are complete. After completing your objectives, navigate back to Earth. Got it. Uh... Well, wait, no, that's... Well, yeah, that's the base. Okay. And now we speed up. And away we go. Oh, wait, hold on. I need engines. Wait, no, no, engines. Well, uh, we don't need weapons right now, right? Nah. More engine. Why the red glowy? That means we're in fast mode. Ready to charge! Charge! And hyper jump! Uh, 
Okay, let's go to the next area. So from here, where do I jump to get back to base? There. Before you return to Athena, we'll explain a little about your captain's piloting modes, all right? You may. Select your captain by clicking directly on them or in the panel. Malka could use some more health. Yeah, Malka's taken a big chunk of damage. Damn. Um, press patrol to cancel this way. Oh, wait, whoa, hold up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Cancel the waypoint of patrol the sector. Oh, okay. Notice how the jump gate was untagged. Tag it again to switch back to follow waypoint to continue the return journey. Okay. So you can, like, set go to patrol mode and you'll just, like, cruise around. Ready to charge! Let's go! Wow! Wow! No, I really like this, actually. This is awesome. It's very, very hectic and, act and active, though. Which is nice. I guess that's kind of how these games go. Tag the station to land. Coming in hot! Let's go! Wait, oh, did I not tag it? I did. Did I not? No, I did. We're landing. Is this like 3D FTL? Basically, yes. Just had to do a big old U-turn. Nice. Enemy forces cleared. A thousand dollars. I can't believe my ship is called the fucking Chub Bucket. Oh, your first name's Levi? Like, like the jeans? Or that dude from Attack on Titan? Captain Levi. I thought you chose that name. No, I didn't. These are all randomly generated. Unlocked abilities. Plots a course towards enemy fighters for more direct confrontation. Okay. Plots a course that keeps the ship's strongest shields facing the enemy. Okay. Reactor boost. Temporarily gives a small boost to the power output of the reactor. Shield replenish. Quickly restore shields to full strength. And focus fire. Titans aim accuracy with a turret for a short period. Okay, focus fire sounds great. Weapons officer got that. What's up, Emerald? What's up, everybody? How you doing? Unlocked gear and upgrades. Uh, okay, light armored suit MK1. A very basic armored suit. It provides some protection without restricting the wearer too much. Battle helmet MK1. Okay, battle helmet with some protection. Got boots and gloves. Equipments. Can you rename them? I think you can. Uh, recruitment. Let's see. This is the recruitment room. New recruits will come here to fill your crew. Bomber crew import. Oh, you can take your crew from the bomber crew game and import them to this game. That's interesting. This is the crew gear room. In here, you can customize your crew's gear. Different crew gear will have different properties, such as resistance to damage, resistance to radiation, or improved mobility. Okay. This is the Crafton. Uh, 35 years old. And you look like that? Is that gonna be me in five years? What? You look like Old Snake. Hometown is Bangalore. Huh. Education, none. <laughs> Good. Yeah, you, you're... Definitely a captain. Definitely a captain. Equip. Okay. Captain has been equipped. What about you? Okay, let's just equip everybody with all this. Equip to all. That's a good feature. All right, so now everybody has little army helmets. Great. 
perfect. Desert, when do you fight Fatalis? Last night! He's here to lead, not to read. Wait, what else do I need to do? Is there any, is there something more I need to do in here? Custom loadout. Ah. Oh, okay. The exclamation marks are just letting me know I have new gear. Got it. I don't have any holsters yet, though. Let's see. Mess hall. So is there a way to, like, customize my, my crew? Like, change their names and stuff? Let's see. Hit. Customize. Oh! Here we go. Perfect. Let's see. What should my captain be? Let's make this captain ours. This will be my captain. Mohawks are cool. Let's let's have a let's have a mohawk. It'll be it'll be purple. And wait, I could be I'm gonna be green. Green and purple! Yes! Facial hair. <laughs> wait a minute, what he's when he's like this, isn't this? <laughs> Who does this look like? Who does this look like? This looks like somebody. Can't remember who. A creeper. Aw, oh, man. Green Buzz Lightyear. Piccolo. Oh, yeah, this looks like Josh. Wait. I'll make... I'll make his mustache, like, black. And then... Can I give him just, like... Just, like... Just... Totally black eyes? Uh... Nah. I was gonna make him a creeper. But I guess I can't. That just looks like he's... Very upset and shouting. Facial hair, have a beard. give him mutton chops? Captain shouldn't have mutton chops. Nah, no, we get this mustache. But let's make it like... Let's make it... What's a good color? What goes with green and purple? Another green. Red. Perfect! He's beautiful. Oh god, he has a soul-piercing stare. He's seen many things out there in space. Your new name is... Crapton. Crapton... Crunch. Crampton. Crampton Crunch. Crampton. Crampton Crunch. There we go. Perfect. Let's customize the rest of the crew. So, this will be our communications fella. Uh, let's see. This should have a randomize button. I'm surprised it doesn't have one. Make them all green. I want him to be blue. And you will have... Yeah, like an old man dome. A dome head cut. With red hair. And... A red goatee. We have a very colorful cast. Yeah. He looks very tired and bored. 
Adrian Malka. All right, you can keep your name. Barua? I kind of want to make Barua into O'Brien. Let's see. Can, does he have... How would I make him O'Brien? That's kind of close to O'Brien's hair. Is there an orange option? Kind of. I got that. O'Brien doesn't have any facial hair. Make them named after chat. <laughs> he can have a buck tooth! Now he's sad. Now he's like, oh. <laughs> This looks like he's got, like, something in his mouth. He's, like, chewing on something. He was pogging desert. He's biting his lip. There's... Wow, there's a lot of these. I feel like he should be frowning if he's O'Brien, because O'Brien must suffer. We need to give him very sad eyes. Like, he's... You know, he's been dealt a bad hand. Let's see. Yeah... That works. This do this looks nothing like O'Brien right now. I don't even know who this is anymore. Actually, what color eyes does O'Brien have? O'Brien DS9. He has... Gosh, I've never even paid attention to this detail before. Operations Officer Miles O'Brien has... It looks like he has, like, brown eyes, I think. Oh, well. I can't really tell with just pictures. Kilometers... Kilometers. Oh. Brain. Wait, hold on. Oh, brain. Kilometers, oh, brain. Perfect. Imagine watching Deep Space Nine and getting lost in O'Brien's eyes. <laughs> it's like one of the best characters. Mate is our security. I kind of want them to be Odo. Let's make her in, let's make them Odo. How, how would you make Odo in this? Need like, I guess that hair kind of works. Now it looks like Rev. It does look like Rev. Harumph. See, Odo doesn't have facial hair. He can't do that. Can we give him, like, angry eyes? Like, very disgruntled-looking eyes? Because Odo kind of looks like he's... he's always, he always looks like something's pissing him off. Name him Burp. He just looks like he's on a roller coaster ride. Or like, he really, really, really has to go to the bathroom. Let's do mouth. This is no longer Odo. I don't know what this is, but it's not Odo. Nah, I'm keeping it like that. Odo doesn't have eyebrows. Oh, right! Is there an eyebrowless eyeball? I think they all have eyebrows. Yeah, they all have eyebrows. Well, that one kind of almost doesn't. There's something pissing him off named Quark. Eh. Oh. Odie. Odie. Eod. Good. 
Good name. Bensley? We'll keep Bensley. The way they are. And Martin. Eh, yeah, I've done enough customization. This is fine. So... Now... I guess... Are there any new recruits? No? Okay, crew's ready. Okay, so low risk clear out phasmid forces or low risk transport supplies. Bounties. No bounties. Let's do clear out phasmid forces. Phasmid forces have been detected in near mer 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 pff, near Mercury. It's imperative we wipe them out before they establish a foothold in the sector. Uh I hope this will work. I'm not very good at aiming in this game yet. I'm sure it'll be fine. We probably won't die. Okay. Captain Crunch. Launch. Crunchitize. Before starting the mission, let's quickly go over some of the equipment on your ship. Maximum overdrive! Equipment is stored in the equipment racks around the ship. You can customize your ship's equipment loadout between missions on Athena Station. There are four types of equipment, spacesuits, fire extinguishers, phase rifles, and medkits. As a training exercise, we start a controlled fire at the back of the ship for your crew to put out. Okay. Oh, brain, go! Put out that fire! Oh wait, no, we need a fire extinguisher first. You're now well, you're he O'Brain was almost on fire. Go! Oh wait, I'm too zoomed out. Uh stow it away. Yes. Occasionally your engines may become damaged. This will cause them to leak radiation into your ship, harming your crew. To repair your engines, you'll have to send a crew member out to sp uh, out of the ship. Make sure they pick up a spacesuit before going out. Yeah, but what if I didn't? Will they just, like, will they implode? Will they be crushed like a tin can? Or wait, if you went out in space, you wouldn't get crushed. You would kind of like, yeah, you would, you, you well, I guess you would explode. You would expand until you are dead. Your organs will be spat out. Gross! We've marked an engine as damaged. Now try out repairing it now. Okay, O'Brain. You better pick up a space suit. Does it why you no kill Fatalis? Where were you last night? Order your engineer to repair the damaged engine by clicking directly on it. Oh, okay. Wait for your engineer to repair the engine. Any crew member can repair, but an engineer will repair faster. Yeah, Fatalis is dead. I beat it last night. It was awesome. Select your engineer. Wait for them to repair. Okay. Hurry up with those repairs, O'Brien. We got a mission to do. Gotta get out of here. Click. You beat Serious Sam 4 last night? Awesome! I'm like halfway through that game right now. It's been awesome. I really like it. You need to use phase rifles at Phasmids to board your ship, okay? So they can also board your ship. It's not just space fight. If one of your crew is incapacitated, you can have another crew member use a med kit to revive them. That's the end of items training. Continue with your mission. I just want the spacesuit. Oh. Well, maybe you should put this away, dude. Uh, stow it away. And now, you return to your seat. We need to navigate to Mercury. Okay. Turn off gravity. Divert power to engines. Where is the warp gate? Here is the warp gate. 
fast mode. Go! Eh? Ready to charge. Oh, right. Charging hyperdrive. And go! Look out to Space Fatalis! What? Fatalis space version. That'll be the next Iceborne update. Desert, no pressure, but don't press the big red button. Oh, the one that O'Brien has access to? I'm sure it's fine. Okay, so we're still, like, navigating to Mercury. O'Brien's, some, for some reason, all the way over there. Okay, there's that warp gate. That's the history eraser button, you fool! This one? This one right here? Don't worry, I won't touch it. Yes, that one. Oh, God damn it! we're being fired upon. Uh, uh. All right. Yod, get to the battle station. Uh, we need gravity so they can get... Oh, wait, actually, I might be able to warp out of here. But I kind of want the EXP. Your shields are down. Yep, I know. Uh, select O'Brien. Shields up, maybe? No, gra turn off gravity. Shields up. There, now our shields are at least regenerating. This... This asshole. Crutch! Captain Crutch! Get to the front gun! Defend your ship, Captain! How we doing? How we doing? Okay. That's one down. Should probably take out the big boys, too. Make them a priority target. Aim accuracy is 46%. Uh-oh. Okay. Target them. What? We got a gunner from behind? And to the side. Oh, not anymore. How we doing? How are you guys doing? Oh, God. Malka's hurt. Malka, you got to get to the fuck... got to get to the fucking hill station. Get a band-aid! Tessa, I dare you to press the red button. It's not time yet! Crunch, you gotta- you gotta start firing back! <laughs> oh god, he- Cap Captain Crunch, you're gonna die! Get out of there! No! <laughs> Oh, God, is there a doctor in the house? Oh, God. I, how do I help him? Wait. Uh. Uh, Malka, get out. Uh, we need to... You need to do... Uh, do you have the healing? Oh, look, he's sliding back in. He still wants to fight. He still wants to fight. The captain's not dead. He's got 15 seconds till he's dead. How do you, how do you heal him? I forget how you do it. Uh. Well, now the captain's dead. Captain is dead. Too late. I, I don't know how to heal him. When someone's downed, apparently you can like revive them, but who does that? The med pack on the wall. Oh, I had to select the med pack. Oh. Oh, right. The band-aid's on the wall. Right. Well, uh. Hmm. I mean, we could we could try. We we won the battle, at least, you know? Uh, revive crew member is not available. Oh, well.
guess what, Bensley? You're the new captain. Have fun. It's a hard job. Ready to charge. Let's get out of here. This mission's off to a great start. Our captain's dead. Hyper jump! Mercury. Just a rock. Who cares? I've got rocks outside my house. Nobody writes home about that. I'm not very impressed. Eh? What is the floaty thing? Clear enemies, okay. I can't believe Captain Pagona is dead. No, Captain Pagona's fine. I am alive and well. But, uh, Captain Crunch, he's dead. Malka's probably going to need to get healed next. Huh? Okay. Gotta take out these dudes, too. Yeah, don't worry about his body. I'm, I'm sure it's starting to stink a little, but it, it'll be fine. Don't worry about it. It's, it's all right. This smell, too, shall pass. Eat him. He he could be used for emergency rations, you know, in case we get stranded. In space. Where are you going? Where you're going, you won't need eyes to see. So we're going to, like, the opposite of the sun, right? What is the opposite of the sun? Pluto. Boom! Okay. Uh, Malka, you should probably heal yourself. You're probably gonna die next. Let's see if we can make that not happen, though. Uh, all right. Well, uh... Now Malka is captain. Return to base. Gotta go back to the system inner quadrant. Uh, out system inner alpha, I think is where we're headed. The opposite of the sun is a black hole. Oh, right. It, yes, that makes sense, actually. Uh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, Brian, please fix that. This ship is falling apart. We probably should turn on gravity again. But, uh... Let's see. Ready to charge? Let's charge. What? That's a super slow charge. What the fuck? Oh, because, well, no, all powers divert to the engines. Um, oh, now we're taking fire? That's great. Oh, God. <laughs> I, we don't have weapon power. Uh, are we gonna make it? I don't have shields. I don't think the universe likes your ship. No, it doesn't. It really don't. Well, at least we're not that dude. Universe really didn't like that guy. Let's, okay, let's, we're, we're on the thing. Let's go. Let's go. Engage. Get out of there. That got a little spicy. Okay. Earth Athena Station. Let's just warp. Let's go. 
So far, so good. We only have one death. It'll be fine. It'll be fine! Are we being pursued? I don't see anyone out there. Oh, God! They followed us! It'll probably be okay. No, it's not okay! Go faster! Must go faster! Must go faster! I hit the charge. Go! What? A minute 25! Come on! I, I can't believe how much time that's taking. This is going to be the longest minute ever. Oh, we don't have weapons either. Here they come. They are coming. Desert has been falling apart ever since the captain died. I, I know. God, I, I'm so bad. I'm such a bad captain. Ah! Well, Brain, why don't you repair stuff while we, like... You know, do things. We call him O'Brain because he's like the brain. He's 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 the brainy boy. He he that's because that's why he's an engineer. You're a better captain than the guy on the floor. Who this guy? I wish he would get off the floor. He's so lazy. Who even is this dude? Get off my ship! Engage! Hit the big red button to revive the captain. Order your crew to lead the ship using any available escape pods. Give them a chance to survive should the ship be destroyed. <sighs> How did the gamepad controls work in this? Oh, I guess I have to specifically enable that. It said you could switch between them, though. Speed it up. This is really cool. This is really good. This really is just like 3D FTL, but like, I don't know. It's kind of its own thing, too. Space crew. I really want to rename my ship, though. It took a fucking beating. God damn. Rest in peace, Crampton Crunch. We need a new captain. Crew is incomplete. Uh, Alonzo. Oh, he's a red shirt. Rays, Mola, Johnson. I like the red shirt. I want the red shirt to be the captain. Yeah. Captain Bandile Alonzo. All right, yeah, we'll go with that. Can he... But can he get, like, the old stuff that... No, I guess not. I guess you have to buy him new things, too. Okay. Well, hopefully this equipment will serve you better than it served the last guy. So... Is there, like ship stuff too? Can I customize the ship at all or is it just like gear? I think it's just ship custom. Um, I think it's just crew customization. It is called space crew. You can rescue crew? Huh? It's a competent looking crew. It is a competent looking crew. You're right. Malka, you are late. You're always late for roll call. Okay, so the other mission we have is transport supplies. Vazmet activity has delayed the transportation of much-needed supplies to the mining outpost. Safely transport the cargo pod to the outpost besieged crew. Okay. Desert, why are there so many of you in every copy of Spelunky all at the same time? Ah, it's just part of my hive mind that escaped. Don't worry about it. I'm sure it's fine. 
Okay, Captain Alonzo, you have the controls. Uh, say something witty before you launch. Uh, and away we go. Why is it the chum bucket? Why is it the chum bucket? Uh, transport supplies to the asteroid belt series. Okay. How do we get there? Oh, safest route is that way. Fastest route is this way. I'm going to assume the fastest route is going to be very difficult. Let's go. I'm feeling ballsy today. Captain Alonzo is the imposter. No. No, not Alonzo. Alonzo would never. I wonder if the reason why it took so long to, to like warp drive is because I lost my actual captain. Oh yeah, charge. Yeah, it definitely seems like that was like a, a because of the captain's loss. Ooh, okay. New type of area. Increased enemy activity. I fucking knew it. Your engineer can use the boost skill to temporarily increase the amount of power provided by the reactor. Yeah, but you, it also says it gives you radiation poisoning. But then again, we're in space and space radiation is going to probably kill us all anyway. So what's a little bit, what's a little bit extra, you know, we can glow in the dark. There's a perk. You better steer clear of those rocks, dude. Boost. Oh, oh, wait, this one doesn't cause radiation. Okay. But where is the gate that I need to? Oh, God, we're being fired upon. To objective. D d boost. Quick. Boost it again. Oh. Uh-oh. I tried to double boost and it didn't work. I accidentally canceled the boost. Fuck! <laughs> oh, Brain, what did you do? Eod, get to the gun! We're taking heavy fire! Steady, steady! Oh, we're ready to charge? Okay, uh, to charge! Oh no, we're in combat, so it's gonna take a, a full minute. So it wasn't because the captain was dead. Uh-oh, sisters! Oh god, we have a fire. Uh, 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 the grab the fire hydrant! Wait, what, what? Uh, uh, Malka, get on gun! Okay, you extinguish fire. Yes, go, go! <laughs> Emergency meeting, I saw desert sabotage the engine boosters. A sabotage? Uh, charging for hyperjump takes longer when there are enemies around, as the hyperjump data must be encrypted. Uh-huh. The comm station is unmanned. Route information and enemy fighter markers are only shown when you have a crew member at the comm station. Alonzo, get on it! Go, oh, Brian, get back to the... The engineer's chair. It's your chair. Uh-oh, this... Oh, God, we have broken shit everywhere. There's a fire hydrant in here. We're almost ready. We're almost ready. Just hang on. Hang on for 20 seconds. Oh God, Eon's gonna die. Get out of there. Kill yourself. Oh, oh man, Marta's gonna die. Get out of there. O'Brien. Oh, Grab the thing and, and do stuff. Good. Uh, 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 ready to hyper jump? Get into the damn chair and hyper jump then. Go! Whew! Oh god, warning asteroids. This was a bad idea. This is Captain Mulgrew of the Destrier. We are under attack. Please help us. 
Sounds like a personal problem. No thanks. Oh, Martin is dead. Wait a minute. O'Brien, what are you doing standing over his corpse? O'Brien, you're very sus right now. Oh, wait, there's a slow time function. I should be using that. Okay, Martin, you get into your gunner's chair. O'Brien, you need to repair stuff. There's a fire on board the ship. I know! There's gonna be a lot of fires soon. We need, we need this and this. Extinguish the fires. Extinguish the fires. I'm gonna fucking die. This is hard. This is actually really difficult. Use the buddy system. They're using the buddy system chat. They're doing it. Okay. Well, Brain, you, you go back into your fun chair. Oh, wait, maybe you should put that back. And maybe you should put this one back. All right, Eod, uh, you need to heal yourself. And, oh my god, what, what, where is my objective? The asteroid belt alpha, okay. Or is that, where do you need to go? Where, what? An engine has been critically damaged, oh god. Oh, there, well, I guess I have to defend the Destrier. I guess I have to. So it's like FTL, yeah, basically. Uh, you, you guys gotta shoot! You gotta defend! How can we defend others if we can't defend ourselves? Stow away. Uh, Brian, get in the ship. Uh, well, no, wait. Yeah, get into the engineer square, uh, chair. Eod, get into the gunner chair. And then, uh, 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 uh no gravity. Weapons time! The engineer can use the boost skill to temporarily increase the amount of power provided by the reactor. Okay. But I don't think I need to do that. But what I do think I need to do... Oh god, I almost sent him out without a spacesuit. I need to repair that engine. O'Brien, you got to go. Don't get shot by any, like, weird space pirate dudes, though. Be careful! Huh? Uh... He did it, right? He, yeah? Wait, where is he? Where is O'Brien? He got hit? What? Oh shit! <laughs> Go back and get him! In space, nobody can hear you scream. Bensley, wait, you're outside the ship without a- Oh. Uh. I don't think Bensley's gonna make it, fellas. Can we? Oh God! Wait, no. We need to. We need a tractor beam. We gotta pull him in. One of your crew is incapacitated. I, I, I'm aware. But he's also out in space. Heal yourself. What is happening here? Oh god, is this like leaking radiation? It is, isn't it? Oh man. I'm I'm terrible at this. The captain station is on Wait a minute, what am I doing? I sent him out without a spacesuit again! My crew is very dumb. This crew will not last. I think it's... 
I think it's over. How are they this dumb? I don't know! How are we this dumb? Captain Station is unmanned. Uh... Oh, god damn. Abandon the ship! Abandon the ship! Martin, you gotta get out of there! Abandon! O'Brien is still just going for a float out there, though. I don't even know where he is. Oh, wait. Well, how do we pull him in? Abandon the ship! Abandoned ship button is not working. Abort. Abort! How does this work? Blow it up. Only O'Brien can do that! That's his- that's his special power! He blows up the ship! What happened? I got real beat up. And I kept sending people outside the ship without a spacesuit because I kept forgetting that very crucial step. Being a crapton is very hard, okay? Uh, so wait, you, you go into this chair, right? And... Hit... Oh, you have to hold it. See ya! <laughs> it's time! Die! Die! <laughs> that went fantastic. I think mission accomplished. Well done. The chum bucket has passed. God damn it. God damn it. Uh, rest in peace. Says. Oh, look, a new crew. Well, what's our new ship, though? Wow. I love them all already. Ortega, Bonnet, Ranasing, Cruz, Sakai, and Sep. The Chum Bucket B. Let's see. Equipped to all, I guess. So at least now they all have armor. You don't get a captain skill until like level six. Don't ask what happened to the last crew. Just don't ask. We took the long, we took the shortcut and it didn't really work out. Their first name is S, and their last name is Sakai. Shut up! <laughs> Get out of here! How's my favorite crew doing? Just came back. Haha! <laughs> They're great! You remember Captain Ortega, don't you? He's doing great. He's doing fantastic. Alive and well. All healthy. Very healthy and alive. So wait, now we are... What? What is the name of our ship now? The Asteroid Dodger. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't know if you ever get a chance to, like, customize them. Like, the names. Okay. We're heading to the gate now, right? Yes. Well, let's take the safest route this time. That sounds good to me. <laughs> Here we go. Earth. The moon. All right, let's go to this objective. Let's just speed along over there. This is a very stressful game, but it's really fun to- Oh god, we got bogeys. Okay. We got bogeys. On our six, seven, eight, and nine. 
You can do this. I can do this! Rada! Divert all power to the weapons! Give us big boom! Make big bada boom! Bada boom! We can do this, we can do this, we can do this. These are baby ships. These are baby ships! Ooh, we took out the shield! Yes, 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 die! And this one! Leave no survivors! Die, die, die! The daddy screamed real good when he died! Okay, Bonnet, you can go back to your, your fun little chair. And Cruz, you can go back to your fun little chair, too. Good work, everybody. Charging up! Is this like a tower defense game? It's more like a management game where you have to manage, like, the roles of the crew, um, what's going on outside the ship, what's going on inside the ship, power diversions, uh, mission objectives. It, it's very, very hectic. It's pretty fun, though. Other games that are like this include, like, I guess Bomber Crew is another game in this series that people really like. Um, but in, like, this genre, I guess you could compare this to, like, FTL. And then there's a whole bunch other ones, too. It's actually fucked up, that Pigma quote. Pigma Dengar. It's fucked up what happened to Pigma Dengar. He became like... He became like part of a hive mind, didn't he? Does it fix your shields? Oh wait, do my shields need to be repaired? Oh, they need to be activated, I think. Or, wait. What's with the power diversion? What's going on here? No? Nothing? All right. Well, uh, Bonnet, you need to get to a gun. Uh... Cruz, you need to get to a gun. Uh... Okay, let's- let's power up the weapons then. You took gravity away. Yeah, I did. Oh, that's the gravi- right, that's the gravity machine. Right, right, right. I thought for some reason that was the shield machine. I thought something was wrong with it. That's it, you just missed FTW3s. Yep. If they happen during stream time, there's not much I can do! Just gonna have- just gonna have to try again another day. Ready to charge? CHARGE! <sighs> what is FTW3? Uh, it's an EVGA 3080 series card. Do what Vinny did and buy a Switch <laughs> midstream! I mean... I don't even have a notification, dude. Neri, the bot you made to, like, tip me off when things were happening didn't do anything. <laughs> it's, it's been dead silent. Neri is the notification. Right, but I don't know what website it is. Oh, God, Cruz is gonna die. Cruz is gonna die. Get out of there! So I wouldn't have known anyways, Nary. Heal self. Okay, now get back to a gun. Oh, it was the 3090s. That explains it. Oh, okay. So it wasn't a 3080, actually. Wait, there's an FTW 3090? That's weird. Ready to harbor drop. Go! No, it was a 3080. Oh, well then, your bot's not working, bro. You're, it's in stock notifier. Oh well, we'll get him next time. Okay, so now we have to defend the Destrier, right? Here we go. 
There's enemies that are going to sneak up on us. Evasiveness will be increased with a higher level pilot. Okay, but, well, I don't think I have a higher level pilot. We're all level one. Did it sell out in 35 seconds? Probably, yeah. It's out of stock now. Oh, cool. Well, I heard a rumor that, like, NVIDIA was saving up all their stock for when the AMD cards come out, where they're just gonna, like, drop a fuck ton of them all at once. Just to compete. But that sounds really dumb, in my opinion. <laughs> Yeah, that's- that's stupid. That's not happening. There's no way that's happening. That doesn't make business sense. You would do it before there was a competition. If you want to compete, you need to get it out sooner. Not yet at the exact same time. What are you doing? They were gone within 55 seconds. Well, I've learned from this game that one minute can last a lifetime. Uh, okay, weapons are still powered up. Cut the engines, we don't need to move. More Daka! More Daka! Daka, 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 Daka! There's a significant chance that there will be an Amazon drop tomorrow. Oh, cool. All right. Well, we'll keep my eyes peeled. Yes, I'm aware the engines don't have power. I am fighting. I am Ben Kaying. I stand where I am and face north. And I will die with 1,000 swords embedded into my back. Standing up. Eh? Oh, well, we can, we can turn the engines back on now. Everyone's dead. Shields go up. Actually, turn the gravity back on. Land at the outpost. There we go. Desert, I miss O'Brain. Who? Who is that? I don't know who that is. Why not just get a 2080? It'll still hit those numbers. Just be- well, if you really want to know why not a 2080, because for the value and bang for buck per dollar, the 3080 is literally the better deal and card. The 20 series is sadly going to start getting ignored very hard. <laughs> they costed way too much for like an inferior product. Even used, they cost more than a 3080, which is just ridiculous to me. Okay, we landed. Return to base. Uh, Kacho, on! I really wish I could rename my ship to my own name. He said the not a word word. Eh? Not a word word? Ain't? You ain't? Which word? Costed. Oh. Well, you know me. I make up words all the time. Just like everyone else. We made up words, remember? Uh, I guess I should go back to the asteroid belt alpha. No, wait. Get, get, get over there. Yeah. Let's go home. Oh god, oh god, O'Brien, oh, wait! I mean, Rana, <laughs> repair the thing! Who's O'Brien? Desert, look out. says that you were a computer smart guy. How do I deal with my laptop being hot as fuck when charging? Uh, to put a little fan under it.
They actually make cooling pads that have like, I guess like, I don't know how well they work though. Laptops are like weird though. There's not much I can tell you to do with a laptop because those are like built on their own like usual. Usually those are built with like proprietary like hardware and like you can't really modify them at all. Laptops are built to die pretty much. Let's see. Oh, from here, I gotta go to art. Uh-oh. Do we have bogeys? We got, we got bad guys. Yup. They're coming in hot. Take them out. Power up the weapons. Let's go. No gravity. Weapons. All weapons. Ready to charge. Okay, charge it up. Two minutes! Jesus! Oh boy. Uh, this is gonna get dicey. Gotta make sure to take out that dude. And all these. What's happening? Oh shit! Cruise is down! Captain Ortega! You've gotta- you gotta heal him! He, revive crew member! Go! You're not gonna die on me! Get him! Get him! Yes! Okay, good, good, good. Cruise is back in action. Get back into the crafting seat. Good work. Eh? Well, we're out of shields. Oh, I. Oh, right. We don't have any shields at all right now. Because we're charging. Oh, no. Captain Ortega, you are in trouble. You need to, like, get healed now. You need to repair that. Uh... Are you gonna heal yourself? Oh yeah, heal self. Whew. Okay, you get back in your chair. You go back in your captain's chair. We're almost ready to get out of here. Almost ready. Two. One. Engage! We're coming home! Alright. And now we just go into the station and land. Neat! Job well done. We did it. We did the thing. Yes, it used to stop jumping to hyperspace while engaging the enemy. It raises the stakes. And everybody loves stakes. With some barbecue sauce. Some people put ketchup on it. What do we got? Level two. Okay. Attack and defensive, reactor boost. Yo okay, cool, we got, we got skills again. Nice, and focus fires back. Standard plating, additional armor plating for your ship. Can I customize my ship now? Yeah, we got plasma cannons too. Yes! Oh, thank God. I was, I was really about to be like, man, they should really let me do that. You had to unlock it, okay. This is the spacecraft hangar. And here you can upgrade the equipment on your ship. You can also customize the appearance and name of your ship. Thank God. Rename ship. What should the ship's name be? 
The... The Pagona. The USS Pagona. Mr. Ship. <laughs> Mr. Ship! <laughs> the Pagona Prize! USS Pagona Prize. Shippy McShip Face. SS Diarrhea! <laughs> Shut up! No! <laughs> Onward until dawn. That's an epic name. Uh, I want to name it Gary. Gary. That's a good name for a ship. This is Gary. <laughs> Where the fuck is Gary? So we can put armored plating on it. Okay. Uh. Oh. Install. You gotta buy it. Oh, okay. I, I see. So now we have better defense for our ship. Systems. Standard shields. We have those. I don't have any upgrades to these yet, it seems. So I can't buy any more. But we did get new weapons. So... Plasma Cannon MK2. Fires burst of highly charged matter. Effective against energy shields, but less effective against ship hulls and armor. Requires reactor power to operate. So that's just a better version of that. So one there. And one there. And the auto cannons. You need you need analog guns. Cause what if you don't have enough power? You know? You you gotta shoot. Might as well shoot old school style. New egg appears to be doing staggered drops. Well, I there's not much I can do about it right now, but uh Thank you for letting me know. You can also upgrade the engines. The escape pods you can upgrade? Escape pod bay. I cannot. Oh, I'm out of credits. Oh, shit. All right. Oh, okay. And you can also customize, like, the fire extinguishers, the med kit, spacesuits. Uh. You aren't upgrading the pods. You are buying actual pods. You had none. Yeah, yeah, I realize that. I have one. I only have one pod. So only one of us can make it out of there. Livery. My ship has a liver? Base paint. Oh, what? Oh, you can decal your ship. Can you do custom decals in this? That's the developer. They gave me the game. It's very nice of them. Well, Curve Digital gave me the game, but the developer made the game. Spaceship looks like a hook. Wings. Boost thing or yeah, that looks like a boost pad. That's Captain America. No aliens. <laughs> <laughs> I like the skulls and crossbones. Oh, you can do multiple decals. Okay. Yo, let's cover this thing in decals. Hell yeah. Lightning bolts? That makes it go faster. And wings. Do you get more of these? I don't even know what that's. Oh, that says UDF. Oh, okay. I was about to say like, what? What language is that? But it's just UDF turned on its side. Base paint. Built-in colors. Next colors. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go with this one. I mean, you can make custom colors too, I guess. Customize. Oh, oh, okay. Here we go. Here we go. Beautiful. Mobolith. You can barely see the decal. Like, well, well you, can, you can't see the lettering, though. Wait a minute. Is 
Yellow engines? We need it to have, like, Pagona colors, right? Maybe the maybe these should be purple. Yeah, there you go. Apparently, New Egg Canada dropped a whole 10 Strixes and nobody else has them. I'm pretty sure this card isn't real. What, the Strix? <laughs> maybe it's not. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. You can select the color for the text. Oh, wow. You can customize everything. All right. Okay. Make it bright colored. Yeah. Like that. Gary. Extra text. Um. Hi. Done. <laughs> Backward smiley face. Hi. I wish you could make it like Comic Sans. That would be perfect. Uh. Don't look down here. Look. Look up. My text is up here. Where's the third text go? This is the ship, but... Beautiful. Beautiful. My ship has been customized. It's... It's perfect. It's perfect. There we go. It, this is the crew training room, and here you can review the skills that your crews have acquired. Acquired. Once a crew member reaches a certain skill, you can train them with a secondary skill. Okay. So, Ortega. Primary skill abilities. Inspirational speech inspires the crew, recharging some abilities and restoring their health. Oh, these are unlocked at, like, different levels. Okay. So that's the next one. We'll actually, no. We'll get evasive piloting next. Then fast jump charge. Then inspirational speech. Learn secondary skill. All right, so I can't do that yet. I don't think anyone can learn a secondary skill right now. Okay. Recruitment? Can I recruit, like, new fellas? No. Uh... Four missions completed. Light cruiser ship upgrades. Available for rollout immediately. This is really fun. Okay, here we go. Low risk, clear out phasmid forces. Low risk, S rescue astronomer. And medium risk, clear out phasmid forces. I'm going to do rescue astronomer. We haven't done that yet. That's a new mission type. We've received classified information that the enemy champion, Hu Pen Garat, has been active in the mission area. Proceed with caution. Eh? Okay, well, here goes nothing. Captain Ortega, let's go! ship looks so silly now. <laughs> Let's see. Navigate to the Saturn Prometheus outpost. Where is that? Oh, this that's the fastest route. That's the safest route. I'm going to take the safest route. That'll do. Ready to charge? Charge it up. And engage. Whoa! 
Desert, how is Fatalis doing? Dead. Dead, 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 dead. 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 Super dead. Mort is. It got better. Are you sure about that? Yup. Very. I've never been more sure of anything in my life. Uh oh. Okay, great. Now we have to defend ourselves. All right, Cruz, get on a gun. Bonnet, you get on a gun. You power up them weapons. Let's, let's find our enemy. Where are they? Oh, hi. <laughs> Literally right in front of us. You and you. Oh, there's one. So yeah, I guess I should prioritize taking out the enemies before I actually activate my warp thing, because then I'm defenseless as I warp. Okay. I think only one left. Is that it? We're good. Looks like we're good to go. Nice. That wasn't so bad. Oh. Rada, turn back on the gravity. Gravity activated. How do I deactivate gravity in real life? That's it, you can't lose this ship. We're not losing this ship. Engage! What's up, Reg? The enemies have to get close and stay still to read all your new decals. <laughs> Don't look down here, look up. Hi. <laughs> Ooh, Gary took a beating. Uh, you, engineer can use the boost skill to temporarily increase the amount of power provided by the reactor. Okay. Evasive, evasiveness will be increased to the higher level pilot. With more reactor power diverged to the engines, higher evasiveness will help you avoid asteroids and enemy fire. Alright. Oh, god damn it. Gonna have to take these fellas out too. Oh, god damn it! Cruise! Bought it! Get on guns! Shit. Okay. I think I'm starting to get the hang of this. This is a very active game. I'm really impressed. This is a lot more like... A lot more active than I thought it was going to be. You have to manage a lot of stuff. You have one more power you can use. Oh, I do, right. Uh, uh, aim accuracy. Who has the gun thing? Focus fire. And I don't have any more power I can divert. The ship needs more crew members. I think this is the max number of crew members you're allowed to have just to make the game, you know. A management game and stuff. Okay, ready to charge? Let's go. Charge. I'm gonna keep them on the gun seats. Go! This is the ship butt. <laughs> Land at outpost. Oop. That's the outpost. There I go, dig -a -a gun. Heal the back while you can. I think I can do that here, right? Huh? <laughs> Thanks for the rescue. The outpost is about to self-destruct. I suggest I suggest we escape the sector quickly. Wait, really? This place is about to self-destruct? What if I just hang out? Hold on. What if I just hang out here for a little bit? Well, my ship's fine. All right, let's go. Who is this person? That's Scott. That's Scott. He's a dick. Yeah, there's nothing to repair. 
at least heal Sep. Oh yeah, Sep should definitely get into the healing thing. Uh, let's turn on gravity so you can get over there faster. And... Gotta find the gate now. Where is it? Uh, Alpha, right? Keep the passenger alive. Easier said than done. I guess I'll boost again. Oh, wow, it really did explode. Huh. Oh, it's emitting radiation. Shit. Power to engines. Get out the fuck out of there. It's leaking space juice. Ready to charge. It's green and toasty and warm. Oh, God damn it. Increased enemy activity. All right. Cupin Garot. Great. We were warned about this feller. Uh, attack! We're going into attack mode. And you, focus fire! Let's see, anyone else have any skills we can do? Fire plat. Oh, wait, shit. I, I need to power up the guns again. Okay, there we go. Oh, God! Oh, there's a fire! Gotta slow it down a little bit. Okay, so repair that. We're shooting all those guys. You're powered up. Okay, looks good. Also, we gotta... We gotta identify enemies here. I'm focused on the big fish, but there's so many little fish. In this vast ocean of bullet hell. Hostile life forms detected on ship. Wait, they boarded us? Whoa! <gasps> oh God! Uh, cruise! Cruise! You gotta, you gotta kill them or something. Ha ha ha! I'll make you cap. <laughs> what, what did he say? Eat what? How do we, how do we fight them? How do we fight them? Ah. Uh, Oh, they're fighting, so they fight like that, huh? Are we still irradiated? Never give up. Oh, God. Oh, God, they're still boarding us! What the fuck is that? Oh, it's just smoke. <laughs> this is going terrible! Get him! Beat him up! Don't we have guns? Don't just let him push us around. Oh, Jesus. You need to heal yourself. There's two guns on the wall, front and back. Where? Oh, shit. Yeah, you're right. Okay, uh, Cruz. Grab gun. We've been fist fighting aliens like fools. Where's, oh, that's the guns over here. Okay. Uh. Captain Ortega. Oh, wait, no, we don't want to be a sitting duck. Never mind. No, wait, you gotta defend yourself. Attack enemies. Crews, attack enemies. This is really hard. Uh, kill self. Okay, we're getting the situation under control. Captain Ortega, get back in your little, your funny little chair. Oh, oh wait, shit, no, wait, go back. Well, actually, Cruz has this handled with their gun. Cruz can attack the enemies. Uh, 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 you need to repair shit. Your rifleman keeps flying back with each shot. Right, because there's no gravity. But I can't really do much about that right now. 
Extinguish. Extinguish! And repair. Okay. Seems like we've got the situation under control. Um, Cruz, well, actually, you. Get a space suit. Go out in space. Our engines are fucked. Oh, God damn it. All right. Now, now go. Quickly! This needs to be repaired? Ah, oh, jeez. Repair it, Cruz. Oh no, this thing's about to explode too. Sakai, can you repair that? Desert, there's a fire. Ortega, quick! Oh my gosh. Extinguish the fire! Go, go, go! You may as well self-destruct. It's not over yet! Look, everything's fine. What if I remove the spacesuit in space? That would be very stupid of me. Okay, let's stow that away. Cruz is, like, dying of radiation sickness. Uh, you get back on a gun. And you... Get back in the chair. Ortega, get back in the captain's ship. Or chair. Cruz. Yeah. Get healed. Okay, there we go. There we go. Jesus. We didn't get to defeat Cupid Garot, did we? Did we do it? Remaining capacity? Desert, your ship is fucked. How? It's fine! Ship is all right. Gonna boost now. Go back to Earth. Desert, the decals. No, no, it's fine. Trust me, it's all right. It's all right. The decals will be. They'll, they'll be fine. We could do this. All power to engines. Go. Here we go. You left the NG outside. Wait, what? No, I didn't. He's right here. Everyone's in the ship. There's a floating thing. You fucking scared me. Oh, wait. Turn the gravity back on. Uh, okay. Well, looks like we gotta do this again. Here we go again. Gravity off. Weapons up. Who's shooting at us? You! Get your ass over here! Okay. Whoa! Uh-oh. Uh... Okay, Rana. You need to pick up a gun again and get to work. Okay, you attack enemies. Uh, ready to charge? No, we're not gonna charge. Cruz, will you put the fucking fire extinguisher away? Oh, just drop it. You're a terrible security officer. Chief of security, more like chief of lazy. Just drop it! Oh shit, did we do it? Yes! Yatta! I guess stow away the gun. Cruz, stow that damn thing away. If you don't put that thing away, I'm going to throw it out of the ship. The decal scared them off. Cruise and their funny little fire extinguisher. Haha. Ha. Classic cruise. Okay, ready to hyper jump. Put that thing back where it came from, or so help me! 
Neat. Tag Athena Station to land. Right. Oh, there we go. There we go. Mike Wazowski! Well, that went well. That was really intense, actually. Mission accomplished. Okay. Very cool. Very cool and not illegal. What kind of level we got? Anyone ding? No, no ding. Oxygen mask. Oh, this oxygen mask contains an extra large personal oxygen supply. Engineering tool. This advanced engineering tool greatly improves the efficiency of repairing ship systems. Standard shields MK2, a slightly improved shield recharger. Okay, it creates fairly basic shielding and recharges slowly. Does it, why do you say okay like Ness? Because he says it good, and I like it. So... Crew gear. Did I... I got new gear, right? Did I not? Holster? Oh, okay. Engineering tool. All right. Well, then that goes to you. Equipped to all, actually. Now everyone has an engineering tool. Faster, better repair. That cost a pretty penny, though. Standard shields mark two. I can afford one of these. Very well. The Gary is coming a long way. It's coming along. And we're doing well. Cool. Look at them. They're beautiful. This is our main cast. Ortega, Bonnet, Rana Singe, Cruz, Sakai, and Sep. Know their names. They are legend. What is the research points? What does that do? Eliminate champion? High risk. Oh boy. Don't get attached to them. Ah. Uh, Okay. There's a bounty for Hupin Garot. We let him go last time. I kind of want to... Wow, okay, very high threat. I don't think we're going to make it. I don't think we're going to be able to do that. Uh, suppose I should just stick with, like, low rank stuff for now. Um, but also... I also guess that I'm gonna switch games now, actually. Ugh. So, this was actually a lot of fun. I actually really liked this. This was really cool. I'm glad I picked this up and that the devs sent it, sent it to me. It's been great. This is a very good quality game with like very engaging gameplay. Like, it, geez, the last two hours really just fucking flew by. This is cool. I kinda wanna check out their other games now. But, uh, yeah, it's like, if you're into Star Trek and stuff, this is pretty much up your alley. If you like the idea of, like, managing a space crew. Very well done. Is that... Is that Quark in the background? No. That's not a Ferengi. It's a Blue Angi. Reminds you a lot of Bridge Commander. Yeah, this is a genre of games. There's quite a couple of well-known titles in FTL. Like, Bridge Commander, the Bomber Crew is another game by these devs. I like... I like the graphical style. I like the gameplay. I could see myself playing this a lot. Like, off-stream and stuff. Um, I guess it's on 
multiple things too, like, like, what is it on? It's on... I want to see all the consoles this thing might be on. Uh... Cons it's on Steam. I think it's on the Switch? It's on Switch. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah, it's on PS4, Xbox One, and Switch, and Steam. It's cool. It's really cool. It's kind of like a roguelite. Yeah. I could see myself getting very addicted to this. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for joining me for Space Crew. And again, thank you to Curve Digital and uh, Runner Duck for uh, the game. It's, it's phenomenal. Very pleasantly surprised how well this game is, like, going. Cool. 